1991 Kansas Jayhawks were a blend of experience and young talent. In the front court, there were Mark Randall, Mike Maddox, and Alonzo Jameson. In the backcourt, there was Terry Brown, an explosive three-point shooter. Good! The point guard was sophomore Adonis Jordan. Five, Adonis trying to do something. He goes to the lane. He dishes. He shoots. He got it. Halftime is here. They began the season with two conference losses, then rang off 10 straight victories to tie Oklahoma State for the Big 8 championship. Into Randall, layup good. And he's fouled by Pittman. It was Roy Williams' first conference title. You know, we really believed in ourselves. I think Coach Williams uh, gave us a great deal of confidence. We knew that if we just stuck to the game plan and did what we were supposed to do, that we could beat, a, be, beat anybody. Kansas advanced to the Sweet 16, where they faced Bobby Knight's third-ranked Indiana Hoosiers. was over as soon as it started. The Jayhawks opened with a 25 to 6 lead and cruised to an 18 point victory. In the next round, Kansas met number two Arkansas. The Razorbacks were heavy favorites and led by 12 at halftime. But Williams preached calm in his locker room. Just do what I tell you to do, he told his players. It will work. Brown and Mark Randall starting the second half for Kansas. Back door, work to perfection, Terry Brown. Alonzo Jameson. That's a three for Alonzo Jameson. Adonis Jordan. Throws it up. In and out. Jameson follows. Baseline. Randall. Oh, that he'll go to the line. The Jayhawks are going to Indy. Kansas was headed to Indianapolis and the final four, the ninth in school history. semifinal Kansas faced North Carolina the Kansas basketball tradition had come full circle Roy Williams for North Carolina in his 30th season Dean Smith North Carolina jumped to a nine-point lead but Kansas would outscore the Tar Heels 17 to 1 and had a nine-point lead at halftime three-pointer you call that one three four Terry Brown. Look at how tight the offense is down low. A three for Kansas. He's protected right back. Fox with a great play on the defensive end. Good save by Kansas. Richie spin. Oh, boy, what a play. Rebound their own miss. Randall inside. The Jayhawks held on for a 79 to 73 victory. In only his third season, Roy Williams had taken Kansas to the national championship game. To the championship game on Monday night. Uh, it was an incredible feeling by, uh, for our staff, the way those kids pulled together and uh, upset the number two, three, and four ranked teams in the country to get to the national championship game. But uh, all of a sudden it did set in our guys' minds that uh, we were playing for the national championship. Duke had been to four of the last six Final Fours and had been denied a national title each time. But early in the game, it appeared Duke would finally find a way. He's all right. He'll call for it. Oh, can you believe he got that high? Final seconds. Jordan will put up the jumper. It doesn't matter. Duke has won its first national championship. Every night when I walk through that tunnel, I get cold chills. 
And I don't care who we're playing and the way the, uh, uh, the students and the fans make me feel when I walk out through there is the greatest feeling that any coach could possibly have. There's no better place to, uh, to be there on game night than Allen Fieldhouse.